Everyone, we are leaving Provo for the moment in the McNeil murder trial. There is breaking legal news tonight. The murder conviction against Kennedy nephew Michael Skakel has been overturned. A Connecticut trial judge has ordered a new trial for Michael Skakel, the nephew of Robert and Ethel Kennedy, convicted of the murder of Martha Moxley, a 15-year-old girl that lived in his neighborhood back in 2002. Skakel sentenced to 20 years to life in prison. He's been fighting for years to overturn his conviction. He has always been denied. The murder went down in Greenwich, Connecticut, in a neighborhood that most of us only dream of, surrounded by mansions and Bentleys. Martha Moxley was found dead outside. Um, overwhelming evidence, according to many, against Skakel. But in the last hours, that murder conviction has been overturned. This is by the Connecticut judge. He wrote for about 136 pages, largely grinding an ax against veteran trial lawyer Mickey Sherman, who represented Skakel at trial. Joining me right now is a special guest, uh, investigative reporter Jane Crawford. She covered the trial live when it happened. She was in court every single day. Jane Crawford, thank you for being with us. What do you make of this decision? Well, it's astonishing, quite frankly, Nancy. I was a reporter at the Greenwich radio station at the time of Martha's death, and I was her first reporter on the scene after her body was found. So I have been tuned in actively to this case for a very long time. During the trial in Connecticut, it was a long list of people coming in who had been friends of Martha's, who had been teachers and employees in the Skakel household. And to many of us, it felt like it was so painful for everyone in the room to be dragging up and dredging up all of this information that so many people involved had tried to put behind them. And Mickey Sherman, of course, as you know, certainly has a way with words and has his own personality. And um, I think knowing the Moxley family a little bit and kind of keeping in touch with Mrs. Moxley somewhat over the years and hearing her commentary every time she has had to go back to court for any kind of an appeal request or anything that was going on has just um, dredged everything up, and it's it well, has Jane, never been over. Well, I mean, I don't uh, understand the acts there, that this trial judge, Jane, I, I don't know if you can hear me. I'm trying to figure out what acts this trial judge has to grind. And, and, and let me get this straight. Uh, out to Steve Kalb with the Connecticut Radio Network who covered the case at the time. Steve, thank you for being with us. This ruling is coming down from a trial judge, correct? Correct. It is. Uh, I just read the uh, the briefs on the stuff on this a little while ago, and yes, it's a, uh, it is a trial judge who has decided um, that there should be a new trial. Everyone, breaking news right now. Kennedy cousin and nephew convicted of murder in 2002. A single trial judge, one judge, has reversed a murder conviction on the Kennedy nephew. As you all know, Michael Skakel was convicted in 2002 in the murder of 15-year-old Martha Moxley.